So the stock market appears to have a bit of a Facebook problem. On Monday, markets got smoked across the board, with the social media giant losing 7% to set the tone for the day. Now, over the last 18 months, it has become a well-worn cliche to note that the FANG stocks have been driving markets higher, and an often aired concern to say that this rally could be undone if just any one of these tech giants were to falter. Monday's action, of course, will be seen by some as worries over a fragile rally coming to fruition. Others will see the sell-off sell as overdone or perhaps even unwarranted. And this tension, of course, is how you make a market. But with Facebook at the center of Monday's market storm, I think we're seeing investors simply caught flat-footed. A lot of the noise has been made in the media and politicians about problems with Facebook's platform and the responsibility the company has for the content on its site. Until now, investors have been mostly complacent on this posing any risks to its future earnings power. But at least for one day, it appears that investors think Facebook's future success is very much in doubt. And the ramifications for that future world stretch well beyond just one social media platform. Now turning to the schedule for Tuesday, the economic data calendar will be blank with the Federal Reserve kicking off its two-day policy meeting in Washington, D.C., ahead of its decision due out Wednesday afternoon. And on the earnings side, the biggest quarterly report will come from FedEx, with markets looking for signs of price pressures in both the shipping market as well as on the labor side.